Who we got in the building, man? Who, 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 who is this guy right here, man? Champ, man, champ, the underscore champ with two Ps. Um, glad to be here, man. Thank you for this opportunity, man. Yeah, thank you for coming. <laughs> That's what's up. That's what's yes, up, sir, man. man. Yes, sir. So let's get right into it, man. Why are you here? Why Why are you here right now? You know what I'm saying? I'm putting you on the spot. <laughs> why are you? Too, what brings you to the Awake Report? Well, what brings me to the Awake Report, man, is um, I want to um. I, I, I want to, you know, just start taking more opportunities and, you know, actually making something out of them, man. And, you know, it's like um, at the same time, the same movement that I want to do with my music. You know, I just want to, I just want to inspire everybody, you know, to to chase their dreams and to do what they want to do and to at the same time be themselves, man. So that's really why I'm here. That's actually like, you know, my whole mindset of behind it. So. I started doing music three years ago, um, and it was it's like uh, I started just to like any other way. Like um, I was like freestyling with my friends, you know, up in college, um, and then like my friend was like, "Yo, you should really, you know, you should really start, you know, rapping." So I took it serious, man. And ever since, like I haven't put the pen down, I haven't stopped recording, and that was three years ago. So you know, um, I just been working, trying to perfect my sound and perfect my craft and everything. So you know, but it really happened. Um, because I was a football player, I broke my ankle, I hurt my ankle. Literally, I was sitting on the couch, you know, watching football, and I just started writing. And ever since, you know, I've just been going on it, so. What I talk about in my music is really, I want to, I want to paint a picture. I, I want to paint a picture in all my songs, and I want them to see my vision and what I see. Basically, I want them to see my perspective. And I feel like my perspective is like a really positive perspective you know, and an outlook on the world. You know, at the same time, you know, I say I'm a conscious rapper, so it's like I'm just really just being aware of what's going on in this world today. And, you know, um, you know, that's really my whole... When you listen to my music, you're going to hear a lot about... You're going to hear me being myself. You know, I'm not going to try to be like anybody else that's out nowadays or anybody else, period. You know, I'm just going to be who I am. And I just want to show people, and when they hear that, it's just like... You know, when they when they hear themselves, when people hear somebody else doing something, it's going to inspire them to do something too. So if somebody sees themselves, they're going to be themselves. Right. You know, and it's 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 a huge it's a, it's a huge responsibility that I feel like I'm putting myself up under. But you know, it's something that I feel like I'm I'm willing to do. You know, because I feel like that's what we need nowadays. You know, somebody who can inspire and somebody who's going to give you a positive outlook on life. Kendrick, J. Cole, you know, like those. I, I can feel that. I, yeah. feel, I feel it. Yeah, you know? man, yeah, yeah. Especially the, 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 the beat, the vibe. Yeah, sir. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, I really, um, uh, uh, another artist I um, really like is uh, King Mez. I don't know if y'all heard about him. He's really yeah. dope. You heard of him? He was on. Sounds familiar. His last song He was on that Compton album with Dre. Yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly, that, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I listen to him a lot. Um, but yeah, he really, um, I don't listen to a lot of too much mainstream no, no more. You know, okay. I just really listen to um, local underground and just real, real artists. You know, right. and real underground artists. So um, that's really where I'm at, and uh, I get my inspiration. But of course, from the from the greats, you know, J Cole, Kendrick, Kanye. Definitely. You know, but those are like my idols, my top three okay. idols. So. Okay. I love track music. You know, I, I love the whole the sound. You know, the uh, everything. But it's just, I just feel like what, what's going on with trap music is not really helping nobody. Okay. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like, okay, yeah, you do wake up, and it's most trap, like, trap artists that, they live the life that they rap about. Mm -hmm. But it's not to shun them, but it's just like, we got to hear something more. We need more. Right. You know what I mean? Like, it's like, it's come to a point where people are just like, okay, like, we get it. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like, we want to hear something real. We want to hear something that we can wake up to every day and listen to and, and know that it's, you know, it's going to help us. Like, um, you know, a good example, Nas, even though he had like his, his tracks, he still, you know, was speaking knowledge and he was intellectual and, you know, giving people. It's funny how music is because it's really powerful mm -hmm. and you could really change people's minds just from how they listen to your music. Definitely. And it's like, if people don't understand it's universal, everybody, you know, they have music, they have rhythm, they have something, you know, so it's like, um, if you take that and you can, you can change people's mind with that and their whole perspective and outlook on life, it's, it's powerful. You know, and it's like, we need to hear the truth, we need to hear what's going on in this world, we gotta, I think about, 
people's kids when they listen to me, my music, you know? I think about the, because they're the future, man. And it's like, you gotta think about what they're gonna be listening to. If right. they're listening to some, I'm in love with the Coco, they're gonna think that's what life is about. Definitely. So it's like, you, you just gotta be real and just be transparent. And you know, you, got, you can't just think on a surface level. You gotta get into it and you gotta really think about, you know, the future, you know, to make your music timeless and to really think about other people when you make your, when you make your music.